this is the Ultrafire uh, BRC18650, 300 milliamp, 3.7 volt lithium ion battery that I got with the flashlight. Let me assemble it, screw it together. This is the Ultrafire 2000 lumen flashlight. I'm turning it on. You can see at this point, uh, 83 degrees. Not bad. Now we're going to have to wait a while, see how long it takes to heat up. Okay. This is going to be done in actual time. And yeah, it takes about 5 or 10 minutes. So. I'm just going to let it continue. Every uh, minute or so, let's see if I have a clock available. I will, um, I will take a reading. It's 3:12 p.m. right now, June 24th. Let's see when it goes to 3:13. I'll take another reading. Let the time go by. It's going to be pretty boring, but just so you guys can have an example. And it doesn't matter whether you leave it on the table or you carry it around, it still gets hot. Because I didn't typically leave it on the table because I was that wouldn't be using it. I would use it, and in my hand it kept getting hot. Okay. Let's see, 313. Look at that, 88 degrees. That's quite a jump from 83. Uh, now 89 degrees. A little bit fast, now 90 degrees. A little faster than I would have thought. 90.5. Just holding down the trigger, seeing if it. 91. Oh, look at this. 91.5. Maybe I don't have to do the experiment too long. 92. 92 again. See where the little red dot is? 92.5. Ninety-three. Oh gosh, look at that! Just heating up like a son of a gun. Ninety-three point five. Ninety-four. Just keeps climbing, getting hotter. Okay, let me take it away again for another minute. Let's see. 314 now, I'll wait to 315. Let's see what kind of jump it'll then make. Maybe this will go a lot quicker than I thought. Thought it took about 10 minutes, 10 15 minutes to heat up, but it looks like it does it much faster. Let's see. Okay, now it says 315. I started this at what 313 96.5 97 huh wow I remember it was at 83 degrees when I started when I first turned it on before I let the uh, so I just took the temperature of the casing so 83 to 97.5 about almost 15 degrees now, just in a matter of minutes. Okay. Let's see, it's 315, 316. I'll wait to, uh, let's see, 317 or so. Three. 
3.16. Let me wait till 3.17. There's the flashlight just illuminating the table. I like that the uh, curves are on the front of the flashlight so you can see if the flashlight is on or not. That's very helpful. I mean, the flashlight uh, has a lot of great qualities about it the multiple settings, bezel, and, uh, the magnification. It seems to work great, except the overheating problem is a severe problem. Sixteen still on the clock I'm looking at. When it turns to three, oh, it just turned to three seventeen. Wow, time's flying a lot faster than I would have thought. Wow, hundred and two. Last time, hundred and three. Last time we looked at it, it was at about uh, three hundred and four hundred and six let me point at the lower level okay lower level okay come up a little bit huh well I'm not supposed to hold it let's see okay maybe I shouldn't hold it sideways or something that was weird 105.5 this is after about five minutes or so or let's see 13 17 yeah i guess it's been about five minutes 105 degrees is heating up i just hope the thing doesn't explode on me i'll stop at 110 which is plenty let's see go to lower reading oh Scanning the bottom. Look at that. Jeez. Hmm. Pretty dang hot. Point five. I go over there, eighty three. Come back here, one oh eight point five. Okay, take it off for a second. I feel it. Yes, it's definitely hot, getting pretty damn hot considering so far this video is 11 minutes long oh no no I got it backwards um, however long it is it's counting down I was looking at how much time is left in the recording let's see 320 right now Let's go to 322 and I'll take a last reading. We'll go from there. Okay, uh, 320 still, 
321 at the moment. Take a, a long reading. Okay, almost done. I, I figure we will be. Okay, now it says 322. Oh, shit. 114, 113. God damn it. Yes. Very hot. Okay, I've let it get hotter than what I have done in the past. Okay, show is over. Hopefully everything came out okay. Thank you for watching the video. Hopefully this will help you repair the flashlight.